Hey guys, how are you? Happy day 86, Captain's Log, start date, June 9th, 2020. It is Tuesday. Hope you guys had an amazing day. I'm trying this Facebook Live thing. Um, I don't know, it seems very dark to, to me. I, hopefully you guys can see it okay. Um, just wanna try something different, Facebook Live. Uh, listen, wanted to give my birthday shout outs today. I wanna say happy birthday to Rochelle. I uh, also want to say happy birthday to Miss Yusuda Lim and also Miss Yin Pollock. Uh, ironically, those were both my son's teachers, one in kindergarten and one in second grade. Uh, they have both uh, since moved on from our school. Uh, ironically, Robbie went to Lafayette for six years, right? Kindergarten through fifth grade. And uh, they have, there are no more teachers left that Robbie had at Lafayette. They've all either moved on, they've retired, they've uh, become principals or whatever. It's been crazy. I don't know what Robbie did, uh, you know, but none of his teachers are even left at that school. So anyway, happy birthday to all you guys out there. Hope you guys had a fabulous day. The weather here in San Francisco was fabulous. Hopefully you guys got to go outside and enjoy a little bit of it. Um, big day in our household. Uh, my wife and I put this off as long as we could. Uh, but we bought our son a phone. Um, graduated eighth grade, is going to high school next year. We just felt it was time. We consulted with friends and family, and it was uh, something we didn't want to do, but we felt this was about time. Next year, he's going to be in high school. He's going to be taking a bus. So I don't know about you guys, those of you that are out there with kids. Um, at what point do you get your kid a phone? So I know my daughter, who's in fourth grade, a lot of her friends, not some, a lot of her friends have phones already in fourth grade. Uh, Robbie being in eighth grade last year, 95% of all of his friends had phones and he was the one that was kind of left out. Uh, but he, he handled it, not a big deal. Uh, they communicate via gaming, right? When they're gaming, they converse and that kind of stuff. But uh, we got him a phone today. It was a big deal in our family. Hopefully we can make the girls wait as long, you know, wait until they're starting high school, but we'll have to see. Um, it's a different world. When you and I were in eighth grade at high school, I don't think phones were even available, let alone, you know, having phones. We were able to, to make do, but we're in a different time. So you got to adapt and improvise and, and overcome. But one of the things I mentioned to you guys yesterday is that we went to Home Depot. And what happens to most of us when we go to Home Depot? What do you say? Like, oh my gosh, look at this, look at that. I want to I wanna change in my room. I want to change my house. I want to paint. So guess what? My daughters did. They went out and picked six samples. Six samples. They want to paint their room. I said, you want to paint your room? Have at it. It's all you. So they went and picked six colors. So we thought it'd be fun if we gave you a little, little demonstration, a little, uh, little survey, if you will, of what color you guys like. Personally, me, I like the pink up here. Can you guys see that? This is the, this is the original pink. This is the color of their room. Two girls are in this room. I'm thinking pink is perfect, but yet, you know, they want to change it up. So I did bring a special guest. Uh, I consult with her all the time for my real estate properties when I do interior design and consulting. So I'd like to bring in my uh, second in command at the Kinoshita Group when it comes to interior design, Kylie Kinoshita. Hi. So we are live now. So there's no retakes, no redos. Okay, let it all hang out. Thank you guys for watching. I see Mike out there, me prima Carla, and Apollo. How you doing, guys? Uh, so why don't you go through the colors, please? Uh, would you like to come on camera, too? And here is the co-founder of Kino Cookies, Caitlin. Hi. Okay. So why don't you guys go through the colors and tell us what you were thinking, what was inspiring you when you saw these colors. Okay, so first we have this like light gray color. Um, this light gray is called Ash, and I think the gray is just really nice, very modern color. Next, number two is called Silk Star. Silk Star is like a creamy, kind of in between yellow, peach, and white. That's number two. Number three is one of my favorites. It's called Belgian Waffle. Belgian waffle is number three, and it's kind of, if you can't see, it's like a peach color, very peachy, very nice. Um, if we come down to number four, number four is called Spice Delight. 
This is number four, Spice Delight. It kind of looks like number two, except number two is a little bit more yellow tinted. This is more like creamy, number four. Number five is this very dark orange, kind of like a tan-ish color, kind of looks like the sun. Number five, that is going to be gold buff. And lastly, number six is this very like amazing, really pretty light white color called silence. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six. If you can't see them, that's one, two, three, four, five, six. We have little post-its on them. So what we would like you to do in comments is vote which one you think is the best. Personally, these two are my favorite. Yeah, I, uh, I like the same too. <laughs> I would have to say, if we weren't going to go with the original pink, I'm really digging this white. What is this white called again? Silence. 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 Hey, my cousin Jason's online. Hey, man, I promise we're going to get you some cookies. Uh, we just mentioned it a little bit earlier in the video. Um, this week is chocolate chip and organic oatmeal with or without raisins. You guys let us know, and we're delivering on Thursday and Friday. Thank you guys all so much for those that have uh, ordered and... and uh, we appreciate, they appreciate the support. So anyway, again, uh-oh, we got a vote for one or two. Uh-oh, so we got a gray in this one already. Live, this live voting is happening right now. Um, but the rest of you, let us know what you guys, what you guys <laughs> think. Um, and again, we, I paint a lot of properties for sale uh, when it comes to my job. And I typically go with a, a white or a, what they call a Swiss coffee. Um, this actually is a very nice white. I may start painting my units this white. Um, uh oh, we got some more. Let's see. Uh, Auntie Tina says one, three, five. My boy Mike says number one, numero uno, the gray. I like that because gray is really in right now. I think gray is very popular. Uh, also, cousin Jason also said gray. We're getting a lot of love on the number one gray. That could be the winner, young ladies. That's his last name. And it is his last name. <laughs> Once you go gray, why too gray? Uh, he's gray and he's proud, guys. Listen, uh, day 86. Want to thank you guys all so much for watching. We appreciate it. What does that mean? Okay. Um, so now this is live. So please uh, subscribe, like, share, comment. Um. Uh, follow, all that kind of good stuff. I really appreciate it. Uh, would you ladies like to say anything? Part, any parting words? Yes. Yes, I um, would like to say hashtag we are better together. Okay, young lady. Um, thank you for everybody who ordered and received stuff from Kino Cookies. We appreciate what you have done. Thank you. Thank you for ordering. Oh, Auntie Tina says, hi, girls. Okay, let's do some hashtags. Ready? Hashtag, hashtag together. Hashtag 415 strong. Hashtag, hashtag 415 better together. 415 together. Hashtag Kino cookies. Hashtag cookies. Oh, Jason says he loves us. We love you too, man. Hope you guys are doing well out there. I see your sister got a new swimming pool. I hope she invited you over. That thing looks pretty sweet. Bye, Carla. All right, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Tomorrow's Wednesday, hump day. Don't forget to vote. One, two, three, four, five, six. We got a lot of ones. We got a lot of ones. All right, Mike. Thanks, Mike. Appreciate it. You guys take care, and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Hump day. Bye, guys. Bye.